This is your three-minute radiation fallout forecast for Wednesday, April 11, 2012, in Canada. Current radar from Environment Canada shows light rain is occurring in British Columbia and along the St. Lawrence Seaway up to Newfoundland. The jet stream and tropospheric convection places both these areas at high risk for fallout, especially the coastal region of BC. In the U.S., Alaskan radar shows potential fallout risk for Juno over the next 12 hours. Hawaii remains clear from an atmospheric perspective, but the ocean is another matter. Please visit Fukushima Facts for links to the radioactive slick approaching Hawaiian shores. Current radar for the continental U.S. shows a rain-snow mix across a large portion of the country, with the tropospheric convection coinciding for the following states. Washington, Oregon, California, Utah, West Virginia, Pennsylvania, New York, Connecticut, Rhode Island, Massachusetts, New Hampshire, Vermont, and Maine. In Europe, Denmark and Scandinavia continues to be at risk from the methane well in the North Sea. Fallout risk is highest for the following countries, southern UK, northern France, Belgium, the Netherlands, Germany for Wednesday, and Switzerland, Austria, the Czech Republic, and Poland on Thursday. When in doubt, if there is potential for possible fallout, avoid all precipitation as a precaution. Nuke Report For the first time in two months, there are no events to report. However, a large concern in regards to nuke plants are earthquakes. Large seismic events were recorded today in Indonesia, Mexico, Oregon, Hudson Bay, Ontario, as well as smaller events in Minnesota and the Upper Peninsula of Michigan. If a large seismic event occurs, be aware of power plants that you may be downwind from. Since several of the U.S. plants in Wisconsin and Mississippi failed recent seismic stress tests, stay indoors or relocate to a safer area to the north or south if you think the new plant near you may be in trouble until you have verification. Google how close do you live to a nuke plant to determine the evacuation radius in your area. This is the reality of humans trying to coexist with nuclear power. Links to various real-time seismic monitors can also be found at FukushimaFacts.com where you can also sign up for Twitter for forecasts, emergency info regarding Fukushima, fallout alerts, or nuke plant emergencies. This message has been brought to you by Radchik in the Orion Talk Radio Network. We care about you because your government doesn't. Stay safe.